Signs of a setback in Westchester County. The number of coronavirus cases linked to a single high school graduation now stands at more than a dozen. CBS 2's Tony Aiello live in Chappaqua with the details. Tony. County Executive Latimer calls this a precautionary tale. A high school graduation held in this parking lot nine days ago, apparently the source of a coronavirus spike with 300 attendees now told to quarantine, all because social distancing during the graduation was inconsistent. It is another pandemic plot twist for the Horace Greeley High School class of 2020. First, COVID-19 forced graduation to a drive-in ceremony at the Chappaqua Metro North parking lot. Now, everyone who attended is under orders to quarantine until July 5th, after more than a dozen tested positive for the disease. People ignoring protocols, including lots of hugging at the June 20th event, appears to be the culprit. Nearly no one was wearing a mask. Uh, it, was, it was as if COVID hadn't even exist for the past three months. The district claims it spread the word about the need to wear masks and respect social distancing. Newcastle police say an effort was made at enforcement with the estimated 300 people there. Officers were going through the crowd. They were putting uh, um, reminders out to everybody. We did not issue any summonses. Uh, most people were complying uh, while the officers went through. Uh, in fact, those two officers now, we, we have them quarantining as well. The small spike in Westchester comes as Governor Cuomo unveiled a literal monument to the progress in New York, a styrofoam mountain to illustrate the steady reduction in cases since the peak in April. He also shamed President Trump for his reluctance to embrace wearing a mask. And an executive order directing everyone to wear a mask. How we're at this point as a nation, and we still haven't done the simple, easy, minimal step of saying you must wear a mask when you are in public. As Cuomo criticizes Florida, Texas, and other states seeing spikes, critics point out the pandemic toll there is far lower compared to New York. New York has seen 161 deaths per 100,000 residents. Florida has seen 16 per 100,000. And Texas, just eight coronavirus deaths per 100,000 residents. The coronavirus spike here in Chappaqua is indeed traced back to people who had recently traveled to Florida. It is a setback, but the county executive, George Latimer, says keep it in perspective. About three weeks ago, Westchester had almost 1,000 active coronavirus cases. Right now, the number is below 500. Live in Chappaqua, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News.